How do you calculate the percentage of light speed a ship with a certain delta V can achieve, accounting for relativistic effects? I was doing some back of a postage stamp calculations on high ISP interstellar spacecraft earlier and realized something. If I design a spaceship which according to the rocket equation has a very high delta 5, close or even beyond the speed of light, in my calculations it was 6.7 million kilometers per second or 22 c, how do you calculate what speed that spacecraft can actually accelerate to? Obviously a spacecraft with a delta V of 6.7 million kilometers per second cannot actually accelerate to that speed with it being faster than light and all, but how fast could it get? For those wondering, here's my math on the example craft I referenced, assuming photon drive powered by 100% efficient antimatter reactions, 1 exawatt of power to the drive equals 3 million kilonewtons of thrust or 337,000 tons thrust. This requires 1.7 million tons of antimatter and 1.7 million tons of matter, 3.4 million total, and can fire for 10 years, assuming mass fraction of 90% tour of approximately 0.08 delta 5 of approximately 6.7 million kilometers per second, 22 c. In the case where the spacecraft can achieve relativistic speeds and no gravity is involved, dollar delta v dollar is actually dollar c dollar times the maximal change of rapidity which can be achieved. So the maximal speed the spacecraft can accelerate to, starting from zero, is dollar $C$ tan h frac delta v c dollar. For example, if the maximal rapidity is dollar twenty-two dollars, then the maximal speed is dollar $C$ tan h twenty-two, approximately zero point nine 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 eight c dollar. <laughs> 